having a, a fashion degree and um, I've personally had uh, depression and anxiety for over 10 years and I guess for such a long time I've always kept it quiet and found it hard to talk about and over the past couple of years through sort of therapy and becoming more open and talking about it I've actually helped myself on my recovery journey and I really wanted to do something to help other people so I kind of just combined all of my skills my own experiences of mental health problems I you know as the brand grows um I will be where I am sort of looking into more sustainable um, fabrics and like packaging and things like that. So I want it to want it to be as environmentally friendly as possible. Um, but yeah, it's just a work in progress. Obviously, I'm a one band, one man band at the moment, or one woman band. Um, so yeah, I am obviously conscious about making everything um, environmentally friendly as possible. Um, yeah, and I don't know if I've mentioned as well that. 10% of every sale is donated to Mind. So I really wanted to give back to, you know, the support that they provide for not only me in the past, but other, you know, thousands of people out there as well that are struggling with mental health problems. I really feel like, I do really feel like it. And I have felt that kind of need for a while, but it took me quite some time to even tell myself that I could do this. For so long, I was putting myself down and thinking, I didn't, why me? You know, I've always felt like a little fish in a big pond and I've said that so many times. But yeah, I think through sort of my therapy and I've had cogn cognitive behavioural therapy, um, I've just built up this kind of, well, different skills and that I've learned. And at the end of the day, we've got one life, like we've just got to give everything a go. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work, but I'm trying to, you know, just going to give it a good go. And that's all you can do is your best, so.